right now, structure and time isn't the uh, an issue because the uh, Holland ISC has came up with a timetable where it's suitable for students staying in Netherlands and outside of Netherlands. So uh, the timetable they've given us is not really conflicting with any other plans we may have. Uh, as for the structure, we were introduced to it during our first session. So again, that's not really a big issue because now we are familiarizing ourselves with it. I would say the biggest issue is probably having a lot of distraction because you're at home when you're studying and sometimes you may get distracted with something you might want to do if you're at home. Uh, yeah, so I think that that's probably my biggest issue. I try to find an area where there's uh, nothing could distract me. For uh, example, I'm right now in my balcony. Uh, here I find it really nice because um, the air here is fresh and there's not really anything for you to look at to distract you, such as like, for example, any uh, kitchen or any cooking that you might want to do. Uh, or video games, but out here there's nothing, so it's really a good place to stay focused during my classes. Well, uh, as a person who also has lost his motivation for a short period of time during this uh, period, um, I would say the best advice I could give you is to try to communicate to your parent as much as possible, because as for me, I felt really uh, sort of scared at the beginning of the pandemic, and um, by talking to my parent every day and hearing their motivation, it motivates me to stay strong and uh, keep doing what I'm doing and that um, everything will be okay. So uh, yeah, I, I w uh, and then uh, I would say the best advice is to, if you cannot be with your family right now, is to try to communicate them because I'm sure every family will have their own way to motivate their own children. So that's my best advice.